Now I want to explain how to add a page in Canvas. I also want to just mention why do instructors use pages? And for me, I think pages is probably the most important thing because a lot of us are using instructors materials from publishers and they will give you a PowerPoint and they'll give you quizzes and they'll give you even discussion assignments. But a page is a place where you get to be creative. You can tell your students the objectives that you're going to be doing that week that you picked and you decided upon. You can add a written lecture, you can add an audio lecture, or you can even add a video there. Um, pages have a lot of uses, so I don't want to say that these are the only ways to use pages, but any anything where you are adding content to your course, you're teaching something, you can put it on a page. Pages usually don't have a point value, but it's where you're doing a lot of teaching. So let's take a look at pages. Please go to your Canvas uh, course and go to a module where you'd like to add a page. So I'm in my Canvas course. I've got my week one module. I have an assignment. I have a quiz. I have a discussion assignment. But there's really not a lot of content of teaching. So I'm going to click this big plus button. And I'm going to click, rather than assignment or quiz or file, I'm going to choose page. I'm going to choose a new page and I'm going to say week one objectives. I'm going to click add item. I'm going to move my week one objective by grabbing it right here and pulling it up because I want it to be the first thing the students see. I'm going to publish it by clicking this little green button. Now I'm going to click on week one objectives as I always do and I'm going to click edit because I want to add some content there. So what I'm going to do is go to a Word document where I have my objectives saved and I'm going to copy and paste them into my page. By the end of this module you will be able to answer the following questions. What is sociology? What is the sociological imagination? How do we determine whether a social unit is macro, meso, or micro? What is a role, and why should I major in sociology? I'm going to click Save. I have my week one objectives. There's no point value here. I'm just telling students what I want them to learn. If I click on Modules, I now have Objectives, Research a Career, Discuss, and a Quiz, but there's no content. What, what are they learning? So again, I'm going to click the big plus button and rather than clicking assignments or quiz or file, I'm going to click page again. I'm going to click new page and I'm going to write week one lecture. Seems like a good name. Again, I'm going to drag it up and click on this little green button. And now I'm going to click on the week one lecture. I'm going to click on edit. And I'm going to add some content. I'm going to go and grab my lecture notes. I'm going to grab my lecture notes, copy and I'm going to paste them into a page. If I want, I can make things bigger by using the rich text editor. I can make this a header. Uh, I think I have another header down here. Why should I major in sociology? I can make that into a header. I click save. I see a little typo in there I have to fix. And my students have a lecture that will help them learn the material. I click back on modules and it looks like I have objectives, I have a lecture, I have an assignment, I have a discussion assignment, and I have a quiz. I feel like I am becoming more and more like an online instructor every day.